Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to another episode of my River Guide French Edition for Corsica. The Vecchio is another creek that belongs to the standard when kayaking in Corsica. Albeit most often it is the more difficult middle section instead of the lower part which is the focus of this video. The put-in is at the bridge to Nocetta and the earliest put-out is the Ponti Altiani on the Tavignano. The put-in is also the put-out for the middle section and where the gorge is located. You should also be awake for the first gap that is visible from the bridge, otherwise you might be awakened. Thereafter there are a few more boulders before reaching the first cataract about 500 meter downriver. It is located below a hotel camping on the left side. The key feature is a large boulder on the left shore. Up to middle water levels you enter in the middle and then have to navigate to that boulder to pass it and then back again to the right side. At higher flows a more direct route down the middle is possible, but there will be holes. Low water levels are at 1 meter 40 with medium at 1 meter 80 and high anything above 2 meter. At low levels the vacuum is technical with many boulders in moderate steep cataracts. Most often there are not many options. The variety increases the more water there is, but some of the smaller rocks disappear as it gets more powerful. The cataract with the largest boulders is in the first half where you enter on the left side and then navigate towards the middle. When you reach the slated rock wall into a still section you have reached a good breaking spot. The Vecchio is especially good for training as one can run many of these sections repeatedly. This rock is at the bottom of such a section. Depending on water level different passages are possible or an optimal choice. The Vecchio has a longer more or less straight middle section. At its end there is another cataract which turns to the left. The difficulty here is that the water runs toward a low rock wall and there is a mostly covered rock in the middle of the best approach. At low levels portage on the left is easy and can also be inspected from there. Then one usually tries to pass on the left. At higher flows there might not be an eddy on the top left but passing on the right side becomes easier. What follows are a few great play spots down to the next bend. At this point the Vecchio has spent most of its energy as it flows under the old and new road bridge toward the Tavignano. At the confluence the Vecchio most often brings more water as a good portion of the Tavignano ended up in the reservoir of the Golo. Now the riverbed is wider with some gravel cataracts. One such rapid has boulders in it that do not hinder but at the end it gets steeper and narrower on the side of a thick old tree but ends in a pool. Further down there are two more rapids over rock barriers that can be great play or training spots or holes. All too soon you reach the old bridge Pont di Altiani where you exit on the right. Of course you can continue further down on the Tavignano to one of the many putouts there. You can find additional information down in the description. If you found this guide helpful please consider leaving a like and if you don't want to miss the next video hit the subscribe button. Until then. Goodbye.